what is going on guys we are back with another great video and in this video specifically we're going to get out and be doing some um bed fishing for bedding bass guys basically this is a uh, spawning season for them so they're just kind of all put up on those uh, gravel beds should be pushed up real shallow this time of year and for those of you guys who watched my channel in years past you all know this is the time of year that i really look forward to as just kind of a really easy time of year to catch some bass so as always, we're going to be using the good old 10,000 fish headhunter. And I mean, not only does this thing catch uh, fish pre-spawn, post-spawn, but especially during the spawn, guys, in this uh, natural license to gill color. I mean, uh, bass just tend to hate bluegills when they're guarding their fry this time of year. So you'll see some really heavy reactions from those fish when you're tossing this, when you're tossing this bait around. Um, and basically... Uh, just like in years past guys, I don't explain as much in this video, uh, but if you guys would like a little bit more of some in-depth explanation as to exactly what I'm doing to catch these fish, or even some underwater footage showing exactly what's happening down there, I will leave a link to all my past years videos at the end of this video, so if you guys would like a more in-depth explanation, or just a little bit more information on how exactly I'm catching these fish, you guys can find that there, skip to the end of this video. Or when you're done watching this video, you can find them there. But as always, guys, I hope you enjoy this video and stay tuned. Basically, like in all the years past, just kind of casting at these fish. Each fish is a little bit different based off how long it's been there because they do get caught more than one once during the spawn. But if they're fired up, guys, you'll be able to tell. I just kind of pitch in there over and over until you progressively see that fish just become more aggressive. Nice. Nice guys, just got us a bass, and like I said, these things get caught more than once, so make sure you handle them well, we're going to get them out of here quick. <laughs> Had to work him guys, I couldn't see him out there. Yeah. Yeah, about a nice one, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, brother. Alright, let's get him out of here. Thank you, buddy. Headhunter, I'm gonna cast past this fish. Right now, he's not even on the bed, so I'm just gonna cast it, pull it up right there, and wait for him. And that's how we're gonna get this fish, guys. Oh, what the? There we go, guys. 
That's a nice one. Oh, nice. Oh, man. Look at that, guys. <laughs> Whew. Nice fish. I don't think I'm the first one to get to him. Nice. There we go. Missed him the first time, but we got him. Nice. Damn, dude, they got you all. You're gonna get your hours in. <laughs> I guess. Oh, I got him. Oh, I'm on the phone with Cody and I got him. Oh, there we go. Nice, dude. All right, there we go. Cody's Cody's on the phone. Check out his channel, guys. It's fishing downtown Denver. <laughs> All right, dude. Well, I guess uh, I'll send you a picture of this, dude. <laughs> That's a nice one right there. There we go. Nice LMB. Good old 10,000 fish headhunter, guys. If you want to get yours, possibly in your first mystery tackle box, use code Fishing Colorado. Link down below. Nice. Oh, thank you, buddy. Just working the shoulder. Little dude. Got him on the head hunter. Come on. Can't get it out of there, bud. Nice little fish. Thanks, little bud. Alright, guys, this is the new Cast King Kestrel Elite BFS. Meant for uh, ultralight baits. So, right here, we've got a 1 16th ounce jig head there. Uh, it's Janko, I think it's like Mike Rogers uh, jig heads they got from Carl's. And then I've got a little Metacraw on there as well that I got from Carl. So Euro Tackle Metacraw. I'm going to toss this in here and try to get our first fish on this uh, Casking Kestrel. Basically just supposed to be able to cast super light baits. Kind of comparable to what you'd be able to do on an ultra light spinning reel. So i toss it out. Ooh, a little farther than I wanted there. Pretty smooth casting. Been working with this fish for a minute now, so. Ooh, there we go. He should strike. Let's see. Oh, he came off. 
drag system feels pretty good though. We just freaking had that one right there. teeth on him. Ooh, came right out too. That's why we say guys keep the pressure. Whew, nice fish. guys little guy Got him. Good old headhunter. Ouch. Ouch. Just a little guy. 